Hi, this is Paul with Skyway Web Design and Marketing. In this video, we're going to take a closer look at the search rankings portion of the SEO reports we provide to our clients. When you first click in to view your SEO report, you will be on the dashboard, which looks something like this. And after you see services provided on the left, to the right is the Google rankings or search rankings. An overview is provided here where you can see the number of number one rankings, the number of keywords where you're positioned two through five, six through ten, and so on. But if you want more information than that, you can click in and view the full report. This is the full search ranking report. You can see that the date is up here at the top and it provides the location where the report was taken as well. Now we've got here at the top, notice that we are looking at five different search engines. We've got Google, Google Mobile, Google Maps, Bing, and Bing Local. And what you can see is something similar to what we saw on the dashboard where we can see the number of number one rankings and two through five and so forth. But we can see it for multiple dates. We've got April 2021 here, March 2021 here, and over time there will be more dates available. We've just been using this tool for the last couple of months and so that's why there's only two dates here. Moving down on this page, the next thing that we can see is rankings by change. This shows a comparison of April 2nd 2021 to March 2nd and what it shows here in the first row is the combination of all search engines and keywords. You'll see that there are 107 rankings that are up, 115 that are down, 90 that are no change, and then 81 that are new in the top 30. And below this it breaks it down by individual search engine. So, for example, you can see in Google, there were 41 search rankings that were up, 22 down, 27 the same, and 18 new. And you can see that for all of the search engines that we check. Google Mobile, Google Maps, Bing, and Bing Local. Now, moving down, we are going to take a look at the biggest and most complex part of the search ranking report and that is the rankings table. This table shows the rankings for every keyword in every search engine that we check. So you can see across the top we've got Google, Google Mobile, Google Maps, Bing and Bing Local, all the search engines across the top of the chart and then on the left side are the keywords that we checked. What we can see in this is the current search ranking and the change from the previous month for every single keyword in every search engine. So for example, for the keyword Clearwater Web Agency, the current rank is 29, and that is a change of down by four. Now there are lots of other indicators in this. If there's a red arrow down, that means that the search ranking has gone down in the last month. If there's a green arrow up, that means that it's gone up in the past month. If there's a gray dot, the ranking stayed the same. If there's a plus, that means it's new within the top 50. The previous month it wasn't in the top 50. Then we also have some other indications here. ORG means it's an organic result and LOC means it's in the local pack. To explain what that means, I'm going to show you the search results. You should be familiar with this, but if you look at this search results page, you'll see the map at the top, and then there's an ad and three listings. This is the local pack in Google, and then below that is where the organic listings are. And so you can see in this local pack, Skyway is in the number one position after the ad. And so if we come back and look at the search ranking report, you'll see that each of these search rankings, there's an indication if it's in the local, 
or in the organic results. And if it's in the local, it will tell you which position, A, B, or C, in that local pack. So you can see we've got these search rankings for all of the keywords in all of the search engines. There are a few other terms in here, or indicators, and so that's why I'm scrolling all the way down to this legend at the bottom, just so I can cover a few others. We already covered what LOC, rankings that are in the local results, A, B, or C is the position in that local pack, org indicates its organic results, third party is something like Facebook, something else where you might be listed. The carousel is probably something that you won't see, but sometimes there is a carousel across the top of the search results. KP, this is the knowledge panel. I will show you a knowledge panel, just in case you're not familiar with it. That is typically shown when you search specifically for an organization. So in this case, if you search for Skyway Web Design Safety Harbor, you'll see the knowledge panel on the right, which provides information about the organization. We've got just a few other things. These icons indicate when one of these things is in the search results. So if there are Google Ads in there, you'll see the ad icon. If there's the local pack, you'll see that in there, like this. And if there's video in the results, then you'll see that in there. One quick thing I want to add is when looking at the rankings table, you're going to see lots of small variations in your search rankings. Keywords will move up a spot or two or three every month, and it's not unusual to see those sorts of fluctuations. What we look at is the overall trend. Scrolling back up, there are a couple more components to the search rankings report. You'll see we've been looking at the rank tracker tab. Now we're going to move on to the tracker chart. The tracker chart shows how a specific keyword, how the search rankings for that keyword have changed over time. It's a little bit difficult to see here because we only have two points in time. We've only been using this tool for a couple of months, so we've got two dates. But you can see that you'll be able to look at three months, six months, 12 months of data as time goes on and more data becomes available. And you can see that for whatever keyword you want to check that out for. Moving down, that information is available in table form. One last tab, the aggregate ranking checker. This is basically the same information on the first tab. You've got the number of number one and two through five rankings and so forth. And then below it, it shows that information in a table form. So that is the search ranking part of the SEO reports. Thanks for watching.